hi everyone. Um, my name is Andrea. Um, I am from BNC and um, very happy to be here at the Own Cloud Conference now with our um, second um, presentation about the, the integration between a VNC Talk and Own Cloud. Um, just a few words about. Um, uh, I'm not sure whether I'm still online. Yes, I am. Okay. Um, a few words um, about um, VNC and VNC Lagoon. Um, we are um, a developer of an integrated, um, an integrated product suite for communication and collaboration called VNC Lagoon. Um, which you will see a little bit of um, within the next few minutes. And we do have um, a strategic partnership with OwnCloud that um, requires us to really have a closer look at the functionalities of OwnCloud and where exactly in our VNC Lagoon product stack it makes sense to introduce OwnCloud files you can share functionalities um, as features. And there are so many places that where it makes sense. So I will um, show you some of them. And let me continue um, here to share you my screen then. Uh, not yet finished. So here we are. What is VNC Lagoon? VNC Lagoon is a product suite for communication and collaboration that includes a whole lot of products. So you see here, we have um, products for a real time communication, VNC talk and channels for kind of like Teams or Slack. We have a VNC mail, a really great uh, email and group bear product um, that is group bear. We have VNC contacts for contact management. We have collaboration solutions um, like our really great project management that is super sophisticated. And we have VNC safe, um, a file management solution that in the best case um, will mean that your files within VNC Lagoon will and can be managed by um, OwnCloud. And let's have a look at that. Just for you to know, our products are totally independent of um, the infrastructure you're using. We are deploying them on um, yeah, any place and any data center you might want. So on-premise, in private or public clouds. Um, the platform is also very flexible for you to select. Um, we are using Kubernetes. We have in uh, our middleware and our backend components on the platform and in the front. And we have really great um, products that um, offer you everything you, f you might wish for in a, a really integrated communication and collaboration stack. But um, enough with, um, yeah, talking. <laughs> Let's have a look. When you look in, uh, when you log into VNC Lagoon, there are um, different ways that um, VNC Lagoon will present itself. Either, for example, like this. So that's an entry screen. Um, you know, our name VNC Lagoon. Um, we, we like seashells and we like to show <laughs> a beach, but um, for customers, this will look totally different. Um, this is another way things uh, can present themselves. You see here, that's a directory service um, where I will show you how we can um, activate and deactivate products. On the right side, you have your avatar, you have settings of all kinds. So this is really your starting point into your VNC Lagoon experience. When we have a look um, at the directory and the user management and um, select any kind of user, um, you see here the users. So this is our uh, development and test platform. So no real people here. Um, if you're concerned about data security here, um, you see the organization that are different organizations and um, on an organizational level, 
you can manage um, the accessibility of products. So some users uh, could have access to only VNC Talk. Other users could um, have access to the complete product suite. And in case you want to change something, you just click it and um, add VNC Safe to it. So now this user will, or this organization and um, all users associated with that organization will now also have um, VNC safe here, as you see, um, to use. So that's about the theory and we turn again to the home screen. So you'll see we manage um, the own cloud um, uh, permissions and users already um, from a directory point of view. So we have integrated um, the directories of own cloud and VNC Lagoon. When you click here, you will see a very familiar view. You have here um, your typical own cloud web client where you can manage files, but that's only one thing. Um, let's go to VNC Talk. What is VNC Talk? VNC Talk is a real-time communication product that gives you access to chats, one-to-one um, -one and group chats, video calls, audio calls, um, See here, video calls, audio calls, screen share sessions, um, pads that is a, a way to co collaborate in real time on documents. You have uh, channels, which is something um, we really love. <laughs> that is, um, that, um, that's a, a way to collaborate on certain content types. You um, add um, text or, PDF files or images, and then you can collaborate, add comments or um, share and um, have a real um, yeah, collaboration experience, a bit comparable, but better structure than, than you're used in Teams. Let's um, go again to um, a chat. Let me select here, band is one of our users. And let's chat with him. And let me share the latest photo with you. Of course, you can share any kind of files, um, but um, a photo looks nicer in the presentation that we're having now. <laughs> um, hi, everyone. So Bernd is online and he's answering. Let me. Um, go here and go to the files. These are, um, is the file management, either on um, this um, view, the files that have been shared in exactly this chat. So all images, for example, or all documents. Um, and here we have this nice little cloud, which is also familiar to you when we click on it, then we have access um, to your own cloud, to the own cloud of exactly this user. And let me go to the photos. And um, here on top, of course, you have um, an option to select all the favorites or share it with you and with others. And you know all the own cloud um, components and functions that you know. So this is really your own cloud client within our VNC Talk um, messenger and real-time communication. But of course, um, as you can think, this is only a first step. We have VNC Mail where there will be an own cloud integration very soon and also other products. <clears throat> but let's go ahead with um, sharing. We have here the photos. Let's select one photo, maybe the Lake Constance, which is not too far away from where I am um, at the moment. And um, this is something you will know, share a public link. That's um, also a way of sharing it very securely. Um, have a link name, let's call it link, password, expiration date. You, you will know that already. This, these are the normal on cloud features. So here the link is copied. I can copy it in here and we have the file. Ah, now we see Berend has shared also an image with us. 
let's take that image and save it to own cloud. How is it done? Open the image. And we could now share it, forward it, download it, but now we will send it to own cloud. Click here. Where do we want to have it? Let's put it in uh, marketing in photos, create a new folder. So new photos, doesn't really matter how we call it now and send it there. Files have been uploaded. What happens if we go here to the files and go to on cloud, go to marketing, go to photos, go to new photos. Here it is. And of course, we could um, share also any photo directly. When we go, let me select a different one. Uh, let's go to home here. Portugal is nice as well. <laughs> and um, we can send it to VNC Talk right away. Click here. And then you're asked again to which chat. And it's sent. Here it is. So this is a really bi-directional integration between um, OnCloud and uh, VNC Talk, where we really have, if you have another look here, um, matched all the features that you're used to in OnCloud. You will see here, when um, if anything has been shared, you have here your favorites, you have here the option to share, this is a folder, so you share the folder with your own cloud users and groups or a public link. And uh, now I clicked on escape. That's, that was not what I intended. Uh, if you go here, you can um, see the details. You can rename um, a file. You can download it or delete it. If we rename it, um, So it's there and we could also delete it, but I, I don't want to do that. Um, I have shared things with others. Shares have been done with me from others and uh, shared by links. And we also have tags of any kind. So this is how it looks like in a live version. And um, the next thing that we are doing, because um, as you have seen here, we also have the option to start video calls and we have something um, like a, a video conferencing and um, yeah, virtual event management solution where you can uh, conduct conferences and video calls with um, many persons. And those um, you would like, of course, to record as we are doing today now um, with this own cloud conference, you can do that with um, VNC Lagoon as well. And then um, it would be nice to have this recording shared right away. Um, in own cloud to have it stored there right away and to um, be able to share it. And that um, is exactly what we are doing now as a, a next step. So um, that will be then also the sharing within um, own cloud of um, our um, recordings. And um, any further ideas that we might have um, regarding this integration in VNC Talk, we will <laughs> do it. We are really in the flow now. And um, the next steps um, will be, if you have a look here at um, directory, because there are so many more products that we have. If you have a look at VNC Mail, that um, is, um, the groupware um, or the, the group 
group web product where you uh, compose an email and attach, this will be the next step um, that you are not able to, um, not only able to attach um, the file from your local um, store or from um, the VNC mail briefcase, which is located here, but also on cloud. So this is not a, a huge further step. Um, this will be um, done also in a very short time and um, many, many other integrations come to our mind that we need to um, be doing um, to really enable our partners also to um, benefit from um, the great um, on cloud files and can share um, functionalities. Um, everything, of course, is managed in uh, the back end in our directory um, in a secure manner. Um, all the products are available in um, different client versions. So, um, as I have shown you here, as, um, a, desktop, um, as a web client, uh, we are using here a Chrome browser, but um, all common browsers are working. Um, on the same um, time, you can use a desktop client for Windows, Mac, or Linux. You can install the products and use them, or um, apps for Android and iOS. And if you have a look at our uh, website here, you go to Downloads, and there you can uh, download the front-end clients free of charge. Here are all the products with their versions. And if you want um, to check out what uh, VNC Lagoon is about, how it works, um, you go to VNC Lagoon Live and um, there's an option. So we, we usually, we work, um, we are very channel minded and we are working for our partners, but here's an option for you to register um, as um, a trial or test user on the VNC Lagoon Live platform. Um, so you can try everything out. You can ask your questions that you might have and um, then um, be, yeah, see what it, all, what it is all about, which products are included. Um, that is the VNC Talk um, service, um, real-time communication, chats, messenger, video communication, whiteboard, and um, everything um, you have around that. The group where, so mail, calendar, and contacts, plus briefcase, and uh, teamwork, that means um, VNC task, task management, or VNC project, um, really, really sophisticated um, project management solution. So what can I tell you more? Um, I had a quick look at VNC channels with you that um, would require some more works, I think, which is also a, a, a really good point um, for a hook in own cloud. And uh, that is something, um, ah, let me show you something else before that. What we have now implemented is something that we call um, a signature um, or a blockchain seal. Let me make a test here, test email and send and seal. So we have um, in the send email here, a blockchain verification of the content of that email. And you can click um, to or scan uh, with um, your mobile, for example, to verify. And um, you can here on the right side also click and you see um, that the transaction is still pending. You know, blockchain is not something that happens within a few seconds. We have sealed it and the verification process is pending. This is, of course, something that um, is also interesting for an integration with um, OnCloud. Just think of um, um, secure um, or blockchain or sealed contracts. Um, that is um, something we are working on and that 
we will share more information about that soon. And exactly this can be also added um, here. That is um, that is our channel. Upload some kind of header. Ah, that is some kind of image. Um, let's copy some text from here. It doesn't really matter. I just want to, you to be able to see some kind of text. Uh, where is it? Here. And um, you have topic descriptions and you have files that you can um, attach and publish this. And now we have um, now we have um, the option to view that content, to work on that content, to, um, to, to um, comment on it. And in the end, um, we can also use the content for collaboration and then um, add a seal to it. So you can also have verified a verified status of your collaboration or of your document together to um, share, and so that you don't have any um, you know any doubts about what you have been um, talking about. So here it is, the new topic with the header. It's not um, such a beautiful header now. And you can relate topics and you can comment here, of course, with um, rich text format. And um, you can now, if we edit it again, we have something that is called smart link. You can link to any other element within um, your VNC channels infrastructure or um, environment um, where you can search with our um, global um, index or with our global search. And let's see whether we have anything with VNC Lagoon. Uh, probably, yeah. So that is a link and we add it and um, you have a preview here. So this is how, in our opinion, collaboration will work in the future. We see a decline um, or a decrease in email-based um, collaboration or communication and an increase in these kind of social media related and social media inspired um, ways to collaborate um, within a larger group of users. Of course, um, you can, um, yeah, define the group of users very, um, very granularly and um, have this as a real secured channel, for example, only for management level or for all marketing users or for your development team or for very specific users only. So this is what, what is always super important to us. Um, we um, want to have nice looking um, applications and products that are easy to use. We want to be as secure as humanely possible. That's also why 100% um, um, of our code um, is open source. And um, we want to make it um, very as flexible as possible. So you, you have seen um, the, the, the the entry page, the start page, that it is um, really um, flexible regarding the design. This is also um, uh, true for all our applications. So every application can be branded, can be um, customized on a very granular level. And the nice thing is when you brand um, you know, the web client, this will be immediately also available on the desktop client and in the mobile apps because we are working with um, one code base. So we, we are not developing um, clients apart from each other, but uh, within one, one um, code base so that you can um, work together with um, everybody that you choose to, be it in your organization, or also you can invite external persons to, you know, video calls, but also to collaborate on certain documents or um, files. 
and um, or in projects as uh, users there and um, security performance deploy wherever you like that's that's what it what is important for us um, of course we have uh, settings um, that go way beyond anything that I can show you. That um, our uh, reason for being here today was the integration of VNC Talk and um, Own Cloud, which I think um, we covered now. Um, do you have any questions? Um, please let me know in the group chat. I don't see any questions so far, but. Um, but um, in the end, I will also be in the Q&A session. Ah, let's see, Bernd has shared a new channel, a new channel topic, where we have multi-conference boards. And um, he also mentioned me in um, the topic um, comment, where we can um, really keep the, the conversation flowing you see here also the mentions of um, new conversations where somebody mentions me in a group chat where I can easily jump to the chat or the group chat. So thank you very much for um, having me here. <laughs> uh, thank you um, for the time we had and uh, please share your questions. Uh, be assured that lots of new things and new developments um, are um, being worked on right now. I will share news as soon as possible. Thank you. <laughs>